Hey, what's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. So you all ask me so often about my workout routine, what I do in the gym, what that consists of. So I'm going to show you my Monday and Wednesday workout this week. Um, normally I lift Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then I do intervals every day minus the weekend to take the weekend off for recovery. My intervals consist of walking on the treadmill at 15% incline. I alternate how long I go every single day. And then for my lift, Monday is leg day and booty gains day. Uh, Wednesday is like upper body and then Friday is back. So I will show you my Monday and Wednesday workouts because Wednesday I'm gonna post this video. So I'll show you those two. Now this is a program that was made for me by my trainer, John Schaefer. This doesn't mean that this, was, this would be the best or perfect uh, program for you and what you're trying to work on. I was trying to work on gaining distance, gaining swing speed, and so far I have done that. Also, with these workouts, your nutrition is so important. So the, the workouts is only really half of it, if that. If you're doing these really tough workouts and then you're not giving yourself, your body, the protein that it needs, then in the end, it's really for nothing because your body is not gonna gain that muscle if it's not having the right nutrients. It will start, your body will start eating away at muscle. I will show you what my workouts are looking like today. And I don't know how much I'll be able to film in there just because, um, just because other people are working out. I don't want to like distract them from their workout and I wanna make sure I'm not showing anybody in the background. So I will try to film as best I can and give you little bits and pieces to my workout, but I won't give away all of my secrets either. All right, so I've got two eggs. I just fried them this morning. I've got half a cup of oatmeal. I do gluten-free oatmeal. Today I put some jam in it just to sweeten it a little, but usually I do honey and put some cinnamon on it. And then of course, my cup of coffee. That's pretty much my every single day for the last four months. <laughs> All right, so I'm about to head into the gym. The music is so loud in there that I'm not gonna be able to talk and explain like what I'm doing. And I don't want to have the music um, be flagged on YouTube. So anyway, I'll explain everything afterwards, but I'm gonna do my quick warm up, and then um, we're getting right into leg day. So let's do it. <laughs>
hear me. Um, so I just finished my lift. Normally, I would take a break. I would go home and eat and then come back and do my interval, but I'm gonna do it all at once today because um, I have a lot to get done before I leave this week. So, and it's my easier interval. So today's interval, I'm gonna be on the treadmill, 15% incline. Uh, I'm alternating between speeds from three speed and four speed for 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off, 20 seconds on, 20 seconds off for 15 reps. So that equals 10 minutes. So I know that sounds confusing, but for 20 seconds, I'm on three speed and then 20 seconds, I'm on four speed and then back to three speed, back to four speed over and over and over until I hit 15 reps, which is the equivalent to 10 minutes. So that's my interval today. It's actually really hard. Um, usually I'm dying when I do it. Um, but uh, yeah, easier interval today and then, then I'll be done and get some stuff done. All right. Okay, so I just got home after my workout. Um, that was my lift. Hopefully you guys can get an idea of what I do. I didn't film every single little thing because there were other people in the gym and I wanted to make sure that I wasn't filming them at all in the background or anything. Like I said before, that's my workout. That's my weights of like how much weight I'm using, how much reps I'm doing. It changes at certain times. It's all designed specifically for me. So if you go and do those workouts, that doesn't necessarily mean that's what's right for you. And I have a whole program that's not just weightlifting. So right now, I'm going to do the most important part of a workout, which is eat afterwards, get my protein in. So I talked a little bit about protein on my Instagram recently, and that got some people very fired up. I said I don't use any synthetic protein or processed protein. What I mean by that is any kind of protein powder. I don't make protein shakes. I don't use any of that because everything that is in that is processed and my trainer doesn't believe in that. He also doesn't believe in protein bars or anything like that. So um, he believes that that gives you like the little pooch, especially on women, that little pooch on the bottom of your stomach. That's what he believes. So I just follow that. You don't have to believe that. If you believe in protein powder, do your thing. This is my video. <laughs> um, I was shocked to see how many people were so mad that I said I don't use any fake protein, which is a lot of protein powders because it's synthetic. It's not a natural protein. The protein I use is from eggs, usually, or chicken or whatever, but usually I use eggs. So I'm about to eat a couple eggs. I'm... I need to go to the grocery store. So I think I have some hard boiled eggs left and that's it. So I'll have two eggs and I'm gonna have some pineapple. And yeah, that's pretty much my Monday workout. It's a long one, it's my hardest one, but then the rest of the week is a little bit easier and I get the hard one out of the way first. So until tomorrow guys. Round two, same thing, eggs oatmeal, coffee, every single day. Good morning, you guys. Obviously, you can tell I went and got a spray tan last night, so I am a little orange right now. Anyway, moving on, we are in the gym right now. Um, I'm in the smaller gym today. Today's workout I can do in this gym, so there's only one other person in here right now, but I'm gonna try and make sure she's not in the background. Um, so we're gonna get going with our warm up on the elliptical for eight minutes and then right into upper body day let's do it
just finished my lift. Obviously somebody else showed up so I had to put my mask on. Uh, I've just finished my lift because I'm leaving tomorrow and I just have too much to do. Again, I'm gonna do my interval right now. I do a, today I'm doing a 40 second on, 40 second off interval. So again, it's on the treadmill, 15% incline. I'll go for 40 seconds speed three and then 40 seconds speed four for 15 reps. This equals 20 minutes. So I'll do that and then that'll be the end of my workout today and um, I'll give you guys a little info when I get back to the house. All right, good workout. Okay, Woo, we're done. We did it you guys, we survived two workouts. I still have one more to do this week. So now, of course, like we discussed yesterday, I am going to have some protein. So I'm gonna cook up a couple eggs and probably have another cup of coffee with that. Okay, sounds like my camera's making weird noises. Hopefully it's not. Yeah, those are my, two of my lifts, two of my three lifts I do every week. Overall, I have gained about, I would say I have gained 10 to 15 yards on my driver in my three wood. And then I have gained probably five yards with my irons, with like overall of my irons. That's nuts. I've been doing this program for not even that long. <laughs> um like months like a few months getting results that quickly is kind of a big deal i'm impressed my overall goal was to gain five yards total with everything so i have already succeeded doing that and it'll just keep going which if you have been paying attention to my social media you see that i keep gaining yardage and then my irons i don't know my yardages <laughs> I never know my urges anymore. So that's great, <laughs> but that's what we want. That's what I've been working for. So anyway, the point is gaining yardage. Hopefully this gives you a little insight into what my workouts look like. Really quick, I just wanted to touch on what I eat every day because that seems to be one of the biggest questions that everybody asks, especially on my Instagram. I, I left a little question box for you guys and so many people had questions about like my diet. I think a lot of people don't understand the word diet doesn't mean you're cutting weight. It just means you're sticking to a plan. So the word diet gets misunderstood a lot. I stick to a meal plan. I don't eat a ton of carbs. I don't cut carbs out. Cutting carbs out is not going to solve all, your, all of your problems. You do need carbs because carbs is what's going to help give you some energy. So like during a tournament week, I eat a lot of pasta the nights before a tournament because that's gonna give me my energy for the next day. Without that energy, your body will start to store fat because it doesn't have enough energy to get throughout its day. So you need some carbs in order to give your body the energy it needs so that it's not storing fat somewhere else. My, pro my diet is a very high protein diet so I have a lot of protein um, throughout my day. Without protein, your body will start to eat away at muscle. So if you don't have enough protein, like eating protein after a workout, your body will start to eat at muscle. I can't tell you that I am totally educated in this because I'm not. I'm basically just copying what my trainer has told me and I'm saying it to you but he is one of the top trainers so i definitely trust it i basically put all my eggs in his basket and i'm just trusting him and going with it and so far it has just succeeded so well it has surpassed all of my expectations so i'm very happy with it i do one cheat meal every week so saturday night is usually my cheat meal and you can eat whatever you want but my trainer definitely doesn't believe in alcohol and he's definitely against it. So I really don't drink often anymore. I don't just do the workouts. I don't just do the meal plan. I do the whole thing. 
and it has become a lifestyle and I really just plan my weeks around my workouts now. So I don't mind it that way at all. I actually love it. I love being on a schedule and on a plan. So it works for me. It's great for me. And basically what John believes is if you want to be a champion and you want to win like a champion, you have to train like a champion. So that's kind of the way I go about it now because I think with golf especially, people don't think that golfers are like the same type of athlete as like a professional baseball player, a professional football player. You're still, I'm still a professional athlete. So I need to treat myself as a professional athlete, treat my body like a professional athlete and train like one. So that's what I'm doing now. I'm gonna try and get a video out for you guys next week even though I'm going to be traveling this week and then traveling home for the holidays, so it's going to be tough, but I'm going to see what I can do, and yeah, I'll see you all in my next video. Thanks, guys.